Lisa Ellison. And it's Allison. from the building on Divisadero. Um, and then, you see, I'm thinking, then, then we should have a mission first. Maybe we should go back and forth, and then a Chinatown person. So we go, okay, so no one is going to do this. Open the hole! Open the pilot! Hi, how are you doing? This predicament that all of us are in here is not just for the seniors, disabled, and children, and families, and immigrants. It is a business plan. The Ellis Act has turned into a business plan. And this means anyone who rents in San Francisco, anyone who has been here for over 10 years, anyone who has been born here and have their family has a rental apartment here in San Francisco will expect to get an Ellis Act for Christmas. One day, if we allow this to happen, we can allow people to push out those who seem like they're defenseless, because obviously we're not. Look at all the people here. Look at all the differences of all the different kinds of people here and all the different neighborhoods that are represented. We can't allow people just to push you out of your home. You deserve a home. If you are alive and you are breathing, you are worthy of everything that comes to you your way. We all work. We all try to pay our bills. We all try to survive in earthquake country. And we've done it. Can we unify together to make sure that this does not happen to each and every person in San Francisco who rents? Yes! Yes! yes. Let's do it. Yes. So here's our story. Um, but I'm James Thornton. Um, our family has been in the uh, Haight um, and Divisadero area for 18 years. Uh, we love our neighborhood. Our building was purchased four years ago by Bonnie Spindler. And we knew there was a clock ticking. Bonnie Spindler is a speculator. She flips buildings for profit. But remember this, she flips buildings for profit. For profit. So we've been there 18 years paying our bills and we have a rent controlled building. So she is not making any money off of us. This is the San Francisco way. You, If you get a great rent control building, the way they can get you out is with the Ellis Act and they can get you out within six months or within a year, depending on your scenario or situation. Um, so we're dealing with this issue, and we believe this is unfair. The benefits of having rent control should be uh, gainful house housing. Um, so we're dealing with the Ellis Act. It's a matter of fact. It can happen to you if you have a rent control building. It's a matter of time. And here's my sister who lives upstairs for me, and she's been there 18 years also. And they put up the SRO, Section 8. Hello, I'm Lisa Thornton, and I have been working in San Francisco uh, for 18 years. I work at Rainbow Grocery Cooperative. Yay! And what's happening is uh, a lot of people that I work with are going through similar situations where this store that we operate and own, uh, a majority of us are being forced out of our homes and uh, are, are commuting from the East Bay and uh, you know it's a terrible thing this is my niece who's two years old and she's here faced doesn't know what's going on but she, here she is being faced with this Ellis Act and it's it's just a shame that you know all these people you know we are San Francisco and San Francisco is changing and it's, it's becoming uh, the home for the rich and the wealthy and uh, we're being pushed aside and and things need to change we really we really need to uh, go to the to the state legislator and we need to change things because this, it's not right thank That's you right. Right. Yeah. Yeah.